Yo, what up, though? How y'all feeling on this Sunday fun day? I just seen something, man. Somebody did a mock draft, and they projected the Minnesota Vikings, man, to make a trade with the Eagles for the number 10 draft pick. That's what I'm talking about, man. Go get your quarterback. And guess which quarterback they have the Minnesota Vikings take it, man? Will Levis. It's like, no, I'll fuck with y'all. Man, they had the Minnesota Vikings, man, drafting Anthony Richardson, man, at number 10. The Florida quarterback. The quarterback with so much upside and also is a mystery, man. Anthony Richardson got drafted to the Minnesota Vikings. The Minnesota Vikings will give the Eagles Pick number 23, a third round pick, and also a first round pick next year. And I ain't mad at that. I don't think that's that's really a lot for real to get your future quarterback. It ain't even it ain't even like three first round draft picks. It this year first round draft pick. Well, you know, y'all swap y'all trading places. And the next year first round pick. And a third round draft pick this year. If that's the case, Minnesota Vikings, pull that trade off. You got to. I know Anthony Richardson, man, ain't played a lot of football. He been at Florida since 2020. I think in 2020, he played in one game. Then, like, uh, in 21, he played probably about five, six games. Then last year, he played in 12 games. But he do got he do got a few football games up under his belt. It ain't a lot, but. And plus, the boy played quarterback in high school. Ain't like he played wide receiver or running back in high school, then, you know, converted to quarterback in college. He's been playing quarterback his whole life. And I know everybody going to talk about his passing completion. He only completed, what, 58% of his passes. I know all that, and I get everything. But if you put enough weapons around the quarterback, his pass completion will go up. Look what happened to Josh Allen. Josh Allen had a poor pass completion in college. And what happened when he got to the NFL? It was somewhat the same. Until the Bills came and got digs from us. And Josh Allen went crazy after that. So, man, like I said in my other videos, man, if you get your quarterback enough weapons, your quarterback should shine if he's a good quarterback. And look, we got JJ here. We got TJ. We got KJ here. Well, KJ be gone by the time Anthony Richardson get the plan, but. Y'all know what I'm saying. Plus, you know Minnesota going to add more weapons on offense. They already got two dog weapons that are going to be here next year when Anthony Richardson do take the field. So if that's the case, the Vikings need to make that trade. Get our quarterback of the future, man. For real. And plus, KOC and his coaching staff can work with Anthony Richardson this whole offseason. Can get him ready. You can put an extra overtime on Anthony Richardson. Because ain't nothing wrong with him. He's healthy. And he ran a 4-4 and a 40-yard in a 40-yard dash. So the boy got wheels. And last year he ran for like 652 yards. And the year before that, he ran for like 430 yards. So and he had like nine rushing touchdowns last year. So the Minnesota Vikings, man. We need that dual threat at quarterback. I cannot preach that enough how bad we need a dual threat quarterback, man. And Anthony Richardson, man, got a lot of upsides that people like. And I, I say this like, 
if KOC think he can get Anthony Richardson to be a top-notch NFL quarterback, man, why not get him? KOC is a quarterback coach. He played quarterback. He's an offensive mind coach. So if he feel like Anthony Richardson is the quarterback he need in Minnesota, I won't be mad at that. And we will have our quarterback of the future, man. So next year, we ain't going to be desperate in the NFL draft for a quarterback. And we do have Kirk Cousins under contract for this year. So, you know, he can learn shit. He can learn stuff from Kirk Cousins on how, how on how not to do a check down on 4th and 12 when your season on the line. He, he look at stuff like that, like, no, I can't do that. I got to throw the ball downfield. So that was a dumbass play. And all the dumb stuff he see Kirk Cousins do, hopefully when he becomes the starting quarterback, he won't do it. So that would be a good fit. Man, I'm telling you right now, that read option with Anthony Richardson and Madison and J.J. out there, man, that shit will be nasty next year. The people be already too scared of J.J. on what he can do downfield. And Anthony Richardson could break it for 20 yard or 30 yard downfield off a of quarterback run. So, man, if Minnesota do do that trade, I'd be happy on draft day. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Man, I would go crazy on the channel if Minnesota trade off an Anthony, man. But I don't know. I don't see Anthony Richardson being on the board at number 10. He might, though. But you know, a lot of people gonna fall in the NFL draft. I could I could probably see I could probably see two quarterback frill going in the top ten or top eight. So Anthony Richardson, he might slip to about number ten. And if he do, the Minnesota Vikings need to make that call. We need a quarterback, man. And like I said before, man, I don't care what the price is, man. Go get your quarterback of the future, man. If you feel like this your missing piece, go get them. And plus, like I've been saying, the NFC is up in the air right now. So we had Anthony Richardson, man, this whole offseason to get them ready. See what we look like in preseason. You know what I'm saying? Then next year, he'd be ready to go. Because, like I said, he's been playing quarterback his whole life. I know the NFL is different playing quarterback from high school, college, and stuff like that. But the boy been playing quarterback his whole life. So if the Minnesota Vikings like him, man, you like it, I love it. Minnesota Vikings, trade up and get your quarterback of the future, man, by any means necessary. We need a quarterback this year, man, for real. So he can sit behind Kirk and he can learn the playbook. And he can learn how to be an NFL player, man. And his you no know, hit rest, this will be his red shirt year. So he won't play this year. But he will also know how to, you know, practice in the NFL. And you know, preseason game also help players out too, though. So, but man, I'm all for it, man. So they got the Minnesota bike and trading with trading with the Eagles for Anthony Richardson. I'm all for it. So y'all let me know in the comment section below, how would y'all feel if the Minnesota Vikings trade up for Anthony Richardson, man, with the Eagles? It ain't no bad trade. I like the trade for real. You ain't giving up a whole lot. But sometimes you got to do what you got to do, man, to get that quarterback. A quarterback ain't going to just fall in your lap. So I'm here for it, man. Make sure y'all subscribe to that channel, man, and tell a, tell a friend about this podcast, man. And make sure you subscribe to that channel and like the video and leave a comment. I'm going to make another video tomorrow, man. But Minnesota, go get Anthony Richardson, man, for real.